G'day fellas, welcome back to episode 5 of Bioforge. So we've now found this new room. There's four freezers over here, one of which appears to have been forced open. There's a panel on the wall here that might shed some light on it. Chamber 1, temperature 73 Kelvin, also known as extremely cold. Engineered species prototype, a cyber raptor. So it killed and ate another experimental test subject, a regenerative plant creature, despite a substantial quantity of plant matter continuing to regenerate itself inside the digestive tract, the cyber raptor still exhibits violent and aggressive behaviour. It kills not merely for food, but for the visceral experience. Lovely. Um, it's been put in the deep freeze because they think it's too dangerous. Chapter t um, Chamber 2. This subject was originally a biologist who was the recipient of numerous implants. These suggested that he would be compatible with cybernetics. Lovely. Chamber 4, a genetic hybrid of a previously unclassified species, an insectoid creature. The subject's skin is coated with a highly potent toxin. Although many animal species of Daedalus appear to be immune, it's lethal to all humans exposed to it within seconds. Subject's blood also contains an even heavier concentration of the toxin, and it spits the toxin to defend itself. Subject terminated. Keep subject frozen and avoid handling at all costs. Good to know. Chamber 3. The last occupant of this freezer unit has soared and escaped. Engineered species prototype. It's a carrion eater, cloning, genetic alteration and accelerated cell growth of a species of insect found in the southern hemisphere combined with human DNA. Oh lovely. This is the last remaining one. The experiment was declared a failure because it's a heavier version of the bright light. Also, it always voraciously hungry. The metabolism is quite astounding. It processes food rapidly and the full limits of its growth potential have not yet been reached. Can reproduct you say sexually. Lovely. We have once again succeeded in produ producing a specimen that has proved to overwhelm the facilities of the insulation which shall be left to another time and place before it can be studied subject should remain in cold storage well that didn't work out for him did it so okay we've got cyber raptor in number one poor biologist in number two and scary mutant insect in number three help So let's head down. We'll open this. And I like the way ladders in this game work. Love this music. Dun, 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 and that's not water down there, it's a highly toxic acid. And yes, you can fall off. Okay, whatever is in there, it's really, really big. <laughs> but it doesn't seem to like bright light. Hey, that sounds familiar. Hmm. What are we going to do? 
and yeah I've played the game before if you go down there all that happens is you get a short full motion video of your body with limbs missing and some other bits missing as well being basically thrown into the ocean um, the thing down there is way too big for you to take on So, we've got a little mystery on our hands. I wonder what this thing does. Hmm. Seems to be a coolant. Uh oh. I think we broke something. Chamber 1, that was the Cyber Raptor. Let's have a look, see what's happening in Chamber 1. Temperature 73 Kelvin, 48 beats per minute. Conditions in Chamber 1 are destabilizing. Please correct. Um, I would if I had any idea how to. <laughs> Temperature's rising rapidly. Ooh! That could have gone better, and I think it spotted us. Yeah! Hit him! Hit him! Come on, we can't let this thing hit us, mate. If it hits us, we're in all sorts of trouble. Ooh. Kiki. Damn, blocked us. Whoo! Looking a little bit groggy. Now you got to do this quick because it will regenerate in about 20 seconds. Bye bye! Ooh. Hey, sounds like something down there is having a bit of a barney. Wonder what would happen? Yep, they're really going on it. We need them to chill out a little bit. What, what happens? Sounds like the fighting has stopped. Yeah, that looks kind of big and it sure looks kind of dangerous. <laughs> And thankfully, it's also very, very frozen. Be careful, ice is extremely slippery. And now we can get down here without getting monstered by whatever that thing was. Now... I'm going to do a quick save here because it's been a while since I played this and I don't... remember which of these doors is the right one. Save over this game, yes. Same as before. <laughs> yep, 
yeah, it's this way, I think. The other two lead to instant deaths. The hand has to be on the scanner. There's something here, I can smell it, it's putrid. Whatever this other escaped prisoner was, it sure made a hell out of these tanks. Maybe this thing and I are on the same side. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Those things got pretty smashed up. the fight with a cybernetically enhanced killing machine. That wasn't... So you need an interesting thing to notice about this is that depending on what you do, I mean you can try and sneak in here, dodge the guy and grab that blaster. Um, and he gets if you kill a lot of people in this game, the guy kind of develops a more sort of bloodthirsty personality. Now we're pretty smacked up. So Time to repair, and we're getting really low on energy. But we now have ourselves a gun. Yeah, yeah. Don't be scared of heights, mate. <laughs> there we go. So yeah, we're moving up in the world. We got ourselves a blast up. Now, you need the blaster because uh, going hand to hand with the hulking Ed 209s doesn't tend to end very well for you. There we go. Very, very carefully. tell you how much I like the music in this game. This game just has really good ambience. And the foley is just perfect in this game. I really, I really like the sound of music in this. So, presumably those things are probably going to end up unsawing sometime. So, um, when they do, Let's make sure they don't come up back here. Now, before I go and maneuver around that robot, um, I think this is a good place to break the video because the next bit ends up being a fairly unbroken action area. So, yeah, until then, fellas, um, we'll just do a quick save. Save this game, yes please. Uh, end of bid 5. So until then fellas, have a good one.